Hey swimmers, hi, this is Coach Kevin. We want to show you the goals. Notice at the bottom here that they're out away from the wall, just about 10 or 12 inches. And so that they're slightly leaning against the wall for good security. And we're talking about the ramps, how they secure to the wall. Um, we just carabiner them to an eyelet or any kind of device. Take them off freely with a bungee cord. Always carry your ramps from the 12 o'clock center section, just like this. Keep some balance, you can hold them with one hand. You can either walk with them like this, or you can actually, if you stay here, you can roll just like this. How easy it is to walk with the ramps, it's real straightforward. Just stay right in the middle here at 12 o'clock, pretty easy. How you doing? Coach Kevin again. Just want to show you how to get the ramps into the water. Basically, just bring them around like this. You can pivot your ramps easily. Again, always remember to stay right in the middle of the ramp here. And then you can spin them, spin them around quite easily. Trade sides. Very easy. And always put this side down in the water. So also against the deck. I just want to show you how to kick the bottom out. You lift slightly. Use your knee, put the ramp in the water. You can even uh, let go, the ramp won't go anywhere, it's just sitting there. And then you can slowly tilt it out, lay it down in the water just like this, and park it, park it in the gutter so it doesn't get away from you. Thanks for watching. Hey swimmers, hi, this is Coach Kevin, and for swim today, let's talk about the boundary system. Um, as you can see, we've got these all roped together with a bungee cord. You can just uh, take that off. We'll use that bungee cord later and set that down. And um, we're going to put this, drop this just right in the pool because we're going to stretch it out. So I'm going to let this kind of fall right down in the pool. But let's talk a little bit about the chain that runs through the whole boundary system. It's a lightweight plastic chain that floats along with the boundary system. And then at each end, we use a carabiner and then sometimes a bungee cord if we want to adjust the tension or adjust the location and position. So we're going to put these in the water. We'll check it out. Hey, swimmers! Hi, it's Coach Kevin with the assembly for the center of the goal, which is the lid, the flagpole, and axle with the rope at the tether, rope at the bottom, and our basin. We're going to put them all together, and we're going to assemble the uh, basin and lid and pull together. The rope just goes right through the lid. Down through like that. Take that in. Then also take the rope and put it right down in the bucket. Put it down like that. Then you can lift it up and pull that through. And you're secure. Just now that we've got the assembly together, remember to always put your carabiner back on the rope here. This is what is going to secure this bottom uh, tether to your chain and your weight at the bottom, your anchor, which keeps your goal stationary in the pool. Near the base of the basin, as you can see, it's drilled with lots of holes, so it fills with water and drains water very quickly. Underneath, we have a tether with a carabiner, and this connects to the weight system, so when you're underwater setting up, just to open that up, put your chain on, secure it to the weight. Just wanted to show you how we work with the bucket or the basin for the ramps. Um, always carry these from this ledge here. Put both hands under, lift it with your knees again, hoist it up, and you can walk with them quite easy. It's about uh, 30, 30 pounds or so, just like that. We're gonna put the lid and basin assembly into the ramp and be, get ready to play. So let me show you how that slides in. It's really easy, just bring it over the top of the deck slide it into the bowl like that, and it'll fall down in place, and you're ready to play. Thanks for watching. Hey, Squirmers, hi, it's Coach Kevin with 20 pounds above the water. We're going to set this down on the bottom gently, like a drop line, with this uh, plastic chain. And as you can see, this chain floats. It's, oh, it's just below the surface, it's right here. Chain floats to the top, makes it real easy to adjust your weight wherever you want it in the pool. We're going to uh, connect the chain, floating chain, on the uh, carabiner under the goal. See you in a minute. Wow. 
Thanks for watching. Hey swimmers, let me show you how easy it is to pull the goal out of the pool. Always do it from the deck. It's so easy, you don't even have to get wet. Put one foot on the ramp, lift on the lid, push your ramp down, bring the bucket up on top. The ramp floats, so it will drain your bucket. And there we go, drains it out. And you bring your bucket up on the top, and you're out. And now that we've got the bucket out of the ramp, let's pull the ramp out and drain it, and let's use the leverage on the side of the pool. It's really easy. Out like that. Just keep it on the side of the pool. Let it drain. Just like that. And you're up. Ready to go. Thanks for watching.